All right. So we are going, I believe the next level is the serpent section. I'm going to save real quick, because it's always smart to save in this game. As you can tell, this isn't the first playthrough I've done. Let my shit stock up. Mm, I should be alright. Let's see about playing with a snake. My controller is broken, so we're gonna see how well it does. Button combination test. Since this is against serpents, I should have put this on the sword. Alright, fucking do it on its own. No, no. Okay, let's do that again. Stop walking on your own. Try it again. Okay, so where the fuck do I get the snake thing from? Hmm. Come here, Mr. Pedro T. 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 motherfucker. Let's see what he's got. He might have something for me. I'm just gonna blabber on again. Maybe you have a... Can't find this place to turn the game down. I can't find a spot to turn the game down. Now. Let's 
I can do it. No, I don't see how it came down. Maybe I'll look into that for the next time I stream or something. That way I can fix my shit. Alright, so I gotta get... The snake is in here somehow. No, I know the snake is in here, but I gotta get him out of his cave somehow, and I do not recall how to do that. Hmm. I got the sword. But I do not remember how to get the flute thing. Let me head back in there and see if there's something I missed. the music guy, you think he'd have whistles of some such degree, but can I go through the door please? There you go. Camera angles for this camera charges. Ooh, don't forget the room, I locked myself in when I compose my music. Can't quite get into my music without that room, I wonder what's in that room. So I think I finish his room, or his house, and he gives me a flute, and then I play the flute, and the snake comes out. I believe that's how it goes. Watch me be completely wrong. Okay. Who's this guy? This is... Kokos. Kokos. Okay. Let's see if... Voila, he gives me a flute. Can you go up the fucking steps? into something. Great. I'm gonna be nice. Should have just said no. <laughs> Legendary hunter. Damn. You have the most beautiful voice I have ever heard. I'm literally shedding tears right now for this man. That was fucking sudden. <laughs> he just stops. Uh, it's an original P, is it now? I don't think anybody else would <laughs> come up with it. Uh, yeah, that was that was amazing. I am astonished. Shows his charisma, huh? With literally no words. Okay, can I have my flute now? No, it was sad. He was awesome. He was amazing. And now he's dead. Isn't it terrible? Well, someone apparently beat him. He wasn't too invincible. Stop. 
talking. I get it. He was right on everything. But... <laughs> this shit song goes hard. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Killer snake. Yeah, but see, he didn't have the special sword that I have. The special snake penetrator. Sure, certainly. I don't even know what the fuck he said, but I would say yeah. Yeah. Can it be a flute, please? Just a minute. I wonder what it's gonna be. It's not like I've been saying the same thing over and over and over and over. <gasps> wow, a flute. But you guys weren't expecting that shit. That looks like an ocarina. That is not a flute. <laughs> but it sounds like a mouse. Oh, don't stray play in strange places or you'll attract mice. Or mice. <laughs> you'll attract snake because it sounds like a mice. I hope it attracts mice instead. That would be amazing. Okay. So, time to go to the dungeon. Hope my controller doesn't have an aneurysm. And let's try to fight off Mr. Serpentine. I used to have the hardest time with these time fights as a kid because I could never get the square and the circle. I never remember which one was which. So I always mess it up. And now that I'm playing now, I'm probably gonna mess it up now. Let's play with some snakes. Damn, he played it without even putting it to his lips. How does that snake not see me? Oh, all of a sudden, is there? chubby boy out of the tree. You guys will see what I mean in a second. Michael? We don't mention the dead songs in this, uh, this chat here. It's a, uh, it's a cringe free zone, please. Thank you. Come on, big boy. Look how thick this little kid is. <laughs> the fucking legs. <laughs> All right, I have you. I wish I could give him chicken. Like, I wish that worked. Here you go. This is a pendant that belonged to your father. and it does not look very appropriate. Because <laughs> he does not look like a very nice man.
secretly. His dad was an emo, and he just wanted to die. That's all it was. I like how, wait, so the snake just leaves these people that are sitting there watching alone, doesn't attack them, he's just like, eh, fuck it. He just lets them go. It's a very merciful snake. <laughs> just get to walk away. Because he was emo, that's why he did it. He just told you this. One day you'll feel useless and you won't want to live anymore. And you'll go die. It's a lot less emotional when there's no voice behind it and it's just text popping up on the screen with repeated music. Hardcore animated tears he's got there. Oh, now he has milk running down his face. Oops. I made a mess. <laughs> I wonder what my guy's thinking. Just turns around, I hate you, and my guy's just like, I'm sorry. <laughs> I've ever seen. It's the most cringy as Naruto, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, this is still just a <laughs> Oh god. Yes, his father is Joseph Stalin. Did he just say he'll be better than me? See, I'm in control of who gets the best upgrades, so technically I can make it to where you're never better than anybody. Even the fucking little cat girl that I can control is better than you. Alright, now we have the pet kid. Or, sorry, the slightly overweight kid. And he's going to open up the gate for us. Because he's so kind. Yeah, going through and fighting giant snakes and huge wolves with claws and all kinds of monsters and such. Will you stop walking the other directions? Damn. I can't wait to buy a new controller. You think he'd be able to do literally what this kid right here does. This is why you have to have him. Wow, he smashed the keyboard. He's important. Uh, Michael, I think you might have spelled one of your words wrong there. I'm not quite sure what a beat pelt is. Sounds kinky, but I'm not sure what it is. And dying to a snake could be a metaphor for dying to the communist cause, or for the dying to the communist cause. What the hell is this? Um... Speaking of communists, I think I found one. I'm just gonna smack his head a few times. There we go. Who 
do. You smack a communist, you drop money. I didn't know they had any. Oh, no, this is one of those mole. Oh, you can't give me them in the water. Man. Now you're dead. Drop something. Okay. Can I have, like, a big chest, please? If I can use my powerful dragon, I think it's just a sword. Picture the Bolshevik Revolution. I'm gonna concur with you on that one. Oh, it's a mole. weapon here. This is the weapon you start out with, this dagger, and it's unbreakable. It, it, like, because weapons here, if, if you use these and they end up breaking, see that it's weapon HP, if that goes to zero, the weapon breaks and you can never have it again. Well, this dagger, it's got a magical spell on it and it can never be broken because it was your first weapon. So you can do something called a status break where you absorb all the power into a spear and then you can hook that spear onto a different weapon. Like I did with this one, see, I took a different weapon spear onto it to make it more powerful. But if you do that, it, you will no longer have a weapon in your inventory that cannot break. So literally, all your weapons have a chance of breaking, or will break when they hit zero. So um, I'm hesitant to turn to status break this because I don't want to lose the only weapon that can never break. I don't know whether I should do that or just keep what I got. A lot of chests. I wonder if one of those is going to be a minute. First, I'm going to get rid of this. We're one for three right now. Oh, two for three. Let's see if Billy here is good. Nope, he's a fucking asshole. And you're dead. Wow, so dramatic. Did I get the mustache key again? Oh, I did. Mustache key. Now, the fight me giblets. Where are all the fucking keys? They're literally all dropping money. I can't leave the area if I don't have the keys to get out. That was weird. He's a big guy. You asshole! Quit lying to me. Oh, there's one. 
So the way this dungeon works is the first dungeon in the game has one key to get to the next level. Ouch. But uh, this dungeon has three possible keys, so you have to obtain all three in, in case that, like, one of them doesn't work. So you got to have all three before you can progress to the next level. You don't have to. It's easy to collect all three of them. Hey, my dick, my knife. Where are you? You're an asshole. Ow, you bit me. You're a bigger asshole than I thought you were. Give me another one of the keys. They're not really keys, they're like treats, but the door is blocked by an owl and owls like certain things. They're like shiny rocks, strawberries, or like tree nuts. So. All three and see which one he likes. You could go to the back door level. So every level has heal first. Every level has, or almost every level has one of these areas. And if you have the special item it requires, which this one so happens to use, this one, it'll allow you to gain access to the back door level. Now the back door level has better loot but the enemies are stronger, so it's a high risk, high reward type situation. Alright, I'm going to switch to her because she's ranged, so I don't have to worry about getting her. God, he got, got fucked. Hurry up. Sweet. She's dead, okay? <laughs> yeah, let's see what happens if I fight you. You 
just stand right there while I bring my weapon real quick and I'll attack you some more. God of Thunder? You'd rather have a, a thunder hammer than a fire hammer? I can do that. I didn't know Thor's hammer was wood. Yeah. He's a god of slightly thunder. <laughs> Satisfactory sound. 
Ooh, I can upgrade again. Yes. Like I can ammo for the fuse. Where does his eyeball come from? I think I have all three now. Uh, uh, yeah, I got it now. No, it's just a matter of exploring. I got some water because I'd be very good. What's over here? That's ah, a big chest. That's a minute. No, it's not. Oof. Uh, I wonder what. What do you think the trap is? Uh, you're you're an expert in traps. What do you think the trap is? <laughs> Curse. <laughs> How the fuck? <laughs> oh god. Oh, that was so well. Oh my god. There we go. Now we can make a board. <laughs> nope. I'm trusting. I trusted a uh, stalker there. Uh, I know he's an expert in traps. <laughs> Let me equip him with his new... Oh, see, it says it's fire, but sorry, we're about to change this into a, uh, into a thunder hammer. Right. I almost don't want to make it into a thunder hammer, though, because look at that fire stat. Oh, what is the ice going to put the turquoise on it? Wow, it's the exact same as the fire. I'm, I'm gonna make them. I'm gonna make it the thunder you know, uh, hammer. We'll slowly build it up there. We'll get it to 30 so it matches all the other. This is a mad. Oh, wait, because it's called a magical hammer. Duh. Looks like it's got a lot of fucking magic on it. But it's kind of called that. Alright. Okay, let's proceed to it. Okay, which, is this a mimic? Oh, wow. Two more chests down at the bottom, right beside the exit gate. I'm gonna let it go before I leave, and maybe there's another big chest. I hope we get another big chest, and then you can guess the trap again, and I do hope it's the trap that you say it is. No, my luck, we won't get any more big chests, though. So I have a lot of luck at getting big chests. Not two little chests. Minix? Yep. And, uh, Minix. Yep. There really is no secret to know that they're a mimic, I'm literally just guessing. But because this game hates me, I'm, I'm just guessing they're all mimics. He doesn't like strawberries. He doesn't like nuts. So he likes shiny rocks. I can actually buy a sword that's made by an owl. It's like, it's an owl sword. Should I buy that? It's expensive as all hell though, it's like 2,500 gold. Yeah, but see, here's the problem, Michael. You wanted to see something blow up, but if I guess it's explosion and it was cursed, I get cursed instead. Instead, it'll just curse me. I wish I could skip this right here, the adventure day thing. Because I don't need to know this, I really don't care. I would just like to skip that. I'll just put the owl shop. There's a box over here. It's got a plant buster in it. 
Okay. So I have a gourd here I want to use. Gourds increase your water level. So while you're in a dungeon, your water slowly goes down. So if you run out of water, you gotta dehydrate to die. So we're gonna increase his water level. I have too much soap. I have so much soap I could drop three bars and I'd be okay. So we'd have to pick up the others. Let's see. I have a lot of stand-in powder, which makes it to where if one of my people die, another one can stand in his place and keep going on. Hmm. I do not have a lot of revival powder, so I only got one. And I do not have any repair powder. I need a lot of those. You're gonna wake. You're gonna wake me or Michael up every day. Like what? With an explosion? <laughs> just blow up his fucking house every day. <laughs> every morning, just set a few bombs and boom. Oh, I got so many items. Okay, I'm gonna sell you some of my soap. It's in my cheese. Cause I got a lot of cheese, and I'll sell you my stones. We need stones these days. Why is there? That looks like a donut. That doesn't look like a whirlwind gem. Not gonna lie. I like my food and stuff at the top. Let's get one of those. Uh, I have plenty of those. Let's get one of those as well. Let's get one of those. Ah, oh, shit, I hit the wrong button. Let's get that. Okay, I could technically afford the Wise Owl Sword. Should I buy it? <laughs> Little house get ready. Oof. Yeah, excuse me, but I don't like copyrighted com uh, content in my, uh, in my chat. Thank you. Um, should I buy the sword? A lot of mon muns to be buying this or to be spinning on a sword. <laughs> Even the owl is saying no. I think he says no for everything. Yeah, he's just, that's his way of communicating. Just imagine if you were to have a conversation with him and he comes up and tries to talk to you, he's just gonna be shaking his head back and forth through the entire fucking conversation. I do need to buy one of those. Now I don't have enough. I can sell a fish. No, I don't know. Okay, so. Did I do it? I don't know how good the owl sword is, is the only problem. Yes. I'm gonna hold off on it for now, just because I'm unsure. Yeah, I think you're right, because you're always buying better swords, and once your sword gets to level 5, like, tier 5, like, um, hold on, I'll show you. like, my weapon right now is tier 3, and once it gets up to 5, it, it, there's really no point in upgrading it anymore, like, it doesn't really go up anymore, at least that's what the game says, so that's when you status break it, and then you just put all its stats into a different weapon and build that one up. So I feel like there's not really much of it in the box over here. I feel like it's not really much of a point, so. Spending that much money on a sword when I'm probably just going to end up status breaking it and putting it somewhere else. Alright guys, next dungeon level. Hopefully I'll, I can finish out this dungeon in this broadcast, and then tomorrow I can do another dungeon. And fight or fight the next dungeon. And then play the game dungeon by dungeon. I wonder if by the time I'm done with this one, will he be stronger or just as strong as my other one? Because I don't remember what his stats are. But I'm not going to play because I have to turn to my... Let me go ahead and put my feather. Put that one there. Alright. Okay, be nice. I just bought a bunch of those. So these balls are called uh, Atla, I think is what they're called. And this is what stores the buildings and stuff that you use to repair the towns. 
The story behind the game is the Big Dark Genie has been... The Big Dark Genie was brought or unsealed, so he started destroying the world. And the Fairy King, the guy who gave you the stone on your wrist over here, he sealed the buildings and the people inside of these things right here before they were killed and destroyed so that they wouldn't have to go to destroy it. And then your objective is to go through, collect them all, and rebuild the town. Now you can rebuild the towns any way you feel uh, good, any way you feel fit, but if you build them in a certain way to where everybody's happy, like the owl guy, he wants his shop to be completely surrounded by water. Ouch. So if you do what everybody wants and you build the town the way everybody likes it, then you get called a special um, attack maneuver. Like, you start off the game by knowing this attack, but if you do uh, the first village, if you get it, Completed the way they want it, you'll learn this attack. So, you just learn this stuff. Are you a mimic? Oh, you're not. Okay. Next trap. <laughs> Let's see if you can get it right this time. <laughs> Counting on you. Feel an explosion. You like those explosive traps, huh? How? How are you guessing, me? What the hell? I got a sex. Twenty-six. It's almost as strong as the one I got. It's not even leveled up. As soon as I status break this, I'm putting it inside the saxophone. That's a dope ass looking sword. And it's fairly powerful already. It's not even up here. Cannot wait. I wish my phone screen would stop turning off so I could watch the chat with Link without having to turn the screen back on. You are the trap master. Michael, every time you've guessed, you have been wrong. <laughs> every time. I'm relying on a spot for you because he seems to be the trap master. How did you still hit me? I stuck a sword in your fucking mouth. Ow, okay, I didn't see you. Okay, I ran into that one, that was my fault. I need to heal before I die from her throwing shit at me. Okay, get rid of the poison. Then I think I'm gonna eat some cheese. Let me guess. Ow! Stop it! How did I just hit something that's not there? Need to be repair my thing. Short breaks. I don't want to break this, so I'm going to make the other one go. I hear it walking around. What is that you? Oh, that's you, badass. Fall over. Ow! Not in there. Because of the fucking trees. Why is nobody dropping anything? I need the keys. Maybe on the next chest I'll go with what Michael says. Oh, 
up and you like nuts. This one is a fan of nuts. I always leave the dungeons for some reason and then stock up make sure everything's good to go so that I don't lose anything important in the next level I could probably run multiple floors at once but I never do can I uh, talk to you guys now? Uh, what do you need? my time to go that torch do you want a torch? what do you want? I've already fixed your house Started to play with him, don't have my laundry, and so I put my laundry. Okay. Let's see. So this guy wants laundry. There you go. And this person wants a torch. And this person needs a sign. I don't have a sign, sorry, buddy. Uh, I assume the old guy goes to the old lady. Yeah. I put the mushroom place. Okay. This had to be mushroom in place. Maybe old lady here. She went out of house or she went out of house. No, that's not. That's the second floor. I don't have a balcony, damn it. Why are you guys asking for so much? Okay, that goes there, this goes there. And a bucket. This is a bucket. Okay. Let me see. I had a picture for this. It tells me where all the stuff's supposed to go. This well goes over here. No, over here. Wait. 
What the fuck am I doing? Oh yeah, I'm placing a well, not a fucking... I don't know what I was thinking. The well goes over here. I was looking at a water well, not a well. Right there. I believe. Yeah, right there. And then... I have two wells, actually. I can place this one. Goes... Down here. Trees still. No, not trees. Okay, there's an event at this house. Is it this one or is it this one? Stop moving on your own, damn it. Alright, let's go see what the event is. Oh my god. It's like I'm in the middle of doing shit and then that just pops up and halts everything, explodes, and I die. I just hate when that happens. I have to go through your whole fucking forest before I'm able to find him. I can't actually go fishing in this game, like, and I have bait and everything, but I don't, who has the time to fish these days, right? Like, I could be sitting and playing on my tablet instead of fishing. Okay, to have a pair of powder. I got plenty of repair powder. I got antidotes. I got enough heals and water. All right, it should be good. Let's go to the next floor. Yeah, it's got a good soundtrack. I wish the soundtracks were a little bit longer because they just. Ooh, this one doesn't. Oh, it's probably gonna make me the hammer guy the whole time. But, uh. Yeah, I just. I wish they were a little bit longer. They just repeat the same sounds. And, and the same music over there. Alright, let's see Thor's hammer in action. He looks so funny when he's like running around too fast. Fight these bitches. I'm already almost dead. Because this guy's attack speed doesn't exist. I somehow hit her. Please don't give me those. Give me any enemy but those. And the beat. No, just don't give me any enemies at all. You know what? Oh my god, get fucked. <laughs> Dear god. Yeah, it does lose a little bit. Let's hope this isn't bad. Funds decrease. Yep, that was bad. Fuck up another bee. Come at me, bro. Bam! <laughs> That's the most satisfying thing. Aww. Whack him all. Aww, I can't hit him as fast as I can. Ow! It's a king in it. Man, get my hopes up. We're about to have another trap with it. Shit. Got 
this bitch again. How did you do that? How did you throw like that? You should play baseball. No one would ever understand what you're doing. Come here, beast. Ouch. Let's see what you're doing. Stop it! Okay, I should have a poison amulet. I wonder how that works. Yes, I know you're poisoned. Curse and freeze. Oh, I don't have a poison amulet. Oof. Guess I'll use this then. I almost did. I should probably eat some chicken. Big boy wants some chicken. Yum yum. Mimic? Nope. Ooh, another sundew. I can technically go to the back door level right now. But I don't want to use that on him. I want to use it on my other guy. And dead beat. Nope, nope, nope. Dead beat. I'm in the hole. Oh, you fuck! I guess I know what to do now. About to get banged. Come at me, B. And dead. What's this do? Oh, that's not good. How would you do that? Yeah, just pin him up against the wall and beat the fuck out of him. Big chest. Oh, is it mimic? Oh, okay. Trap quiz number three. What we got? If you go three for three, I swear. Oh, what the fuck was that in my voice? If you go three for three, three is not a number. If you go three for three, I swear. I did say I was going to say do what Michael said, but I don't know. I want you both to say, I'll do what Michael said, but I want you both to put your thing, and I want to see if uh, Justin gets it still, even if I'm wrong. Actually, before I open it, let me make sure I'm in full health. Yeah, you think it's a curse? Michael, are you still watching? What do you think it is? He probably takes this fucking explosion just because he wants to see something blow up. Soon. I guess I'll go with the curse. And nine, eight, seven, six, four, three, two. All right, I'm gonna go with the curse. <laughs> oh my God! Is it another hammer. What is this? Interesting. Oh, you both said curse. You guys are, like, how are you? I never get these right, and you guys are guessing them every time. Like, you guys must be gods. 30, 20, ooh, this is even better than the sax. I wonder. Should I status break this, put it inside the sax? and then build it up in the status break it and put it inside the chopper or should I just status break this and put it straight into the chopper does it end up being stronger if I status break this and put it in this and then put it in this but it'll take a lot more time actually stronger than what I'm using for him. Alright, let's go ahead and finish this level with this guy. Not you. I don't like you. The fucking mighty healer. I got an F. Ah! Fuck you! I believe I've got everything. I don't want to deal with you.
By the way, on the map, the little yellow dots are chests, and the green dots are um, the Atla, which aren't going to show up on this level because I'm not able to use the gauntlet because it's restricted to the little kid. the next floor, even though I don't have any more antidote drinks. I'm going to switch to code. Unless that's the name I have to call PK, but it's a different name. How did you poison me? Fighting your large fart cloud. Don't you do it. Go away. Just shoot your little light ball at me, please. Stop doing that. This forest is literally full of nothing but like bad effects. Like, the last dungeon kept giving me good shit. Now it's just like, man, we're gonna lower all your stuff. And it's like, I don't want it. By the way. You were talking about you responded for like three minutes. I can't. You're seeing things about 10, 20 seconds after I say them, so there's going to be a large delay between when I actually see the things in chat and when I actually get there. It's like when I get to the chest, I have to sit and wait a while for you guys to actually respond because I'm getting to it and then there's like a 10 second interval before you guys actually see me get to it and that's when you send it in. So it's just like, it's the same thing when somebody streams Rocket League, like it's just, it's just a delay when you stream. Run the back door level. 
games I can get from Mad. Um, experience games from running the back door level. Unless I get an antidote, get an antidote. I'm gonna run the back door level. Anything happens, I can just revive my guy. Maybe he'll revive not poisoned. That'd be nice. just called Halloween. Not like Halloween Scarecrow, not Halloween Pumpkin, just Halloween. He's the entire holiday. Water. Throw something at him. 
with poison. That literally did nothing. Glad I used it. Oh wait, no, he's taking damage slowly. And he didn't even drop it. I actually don't know. I've played this game for years and I've never actually found out why that is. My guy is about to die. Going on. But, uh, yeah, like I've never actually found out why the name got to take the week. Ouch. Trying to go around you, asshole. Okay, my weapon can be upgraded again. Let's level that up. Okay, so now that it's level five, it's status. I'll get smushed down into a little sphere. And I can take that little sphere and I can put it in the sacks. If I put it in the sacks, the sacks is going to go up to 44 damage. If I put it in the chopper, it'll go up to 48 damage. But I kind of want to put it in the sacks and upgrade the sacks to max. And then... Get it upgraded to a certain point, you can actually build it up to a new entire, like an entirely new weapon. That's interesting as well. I might play. Can I do that with this one? No, that's just status break. But this one. Let 
down here. morning wake up everybody all right let's head to the wise out shop am i still poisoned or did it heal oh it healed cool okay. you guys want to see what the first village looks like i've already repaired it to full and everything Don't you wish games nowadays had this fast a loading time? It just shows the fucking name and then poop you're there. This is the first village you go to. It's got a big ass windmill. But the dungeons over here that you go through, and it's really it's like a dirt cave dungeon, it's not like a forest or anything, it's just dirt. And the mayor's house. So you start out, this is where you start the game at. And this whole place is completely blank. There's no houses. The only thing that's here is this hill right here with the steps and stuff with that, that crash submarine right there. And the mayor's in there. And he gives you some stuff. Other than that, there's nothing here. It's just completely blank. And so you go to the dungeon and you collect the first atla and then you build your first town. Looks like modern day Belgium. That is a nice thing to have. Increased attack is always a pleasant thing. Maybe it's 46. Look how much that this fucking circle changes the stats. It's in Schnein. Right. Damn, it's not even up to build up stats. Four. Nuclear wasteland. Well, it's not complete nuclear wasteland. There's a few homes, like five, 
six, seven, there's seven homes. I mean, it's not completely barren wasteland. Then you have the mayor up here, this stingy ass fucker who won't give you anything anymore. All right. I mean, I, I could technically, because I've already learned the move, I could like destroy all their homes. <laughs> <laughs> just take all their shit, like just destroy everything. Because I've already learned the move, so there's no point. Like I don't actually have to leave them this way anymore. And I can build the town any way I wish. <laughs> Must be Holland because of windmills. There's actually four windmills. right no I didn't do that right that one should go that way and then that one should go that way yes So I have 25. Let's see. Can I fit a house in there? I can. I'll put a house there. I'll put a house there. <laughs> I'll put a house there. I'll put a house there and I'll put a bridge in front of each one. <laughs> All right. I got some extra river over here. Where should I put some river? Just put it in front of the mayor's steps so that he can't go anywhere. facing that way or do I want it facing that way towards the road? I think I'm going to make them all facing towards the road. There we go. We'll keep the bridges there just because. My stream just got blocked in Germany. <laughs> Trust me. I will never be famous enough to get blocked in the country. Scatter some trees here and there. I'm liking this town, guys. It's looking up. It's looking pretty. It's looking very nice. We put the pond very far away because we know the Germans didn't get any drinks. We all died. Uh, 
We'll put the merchant over here with the, the pond. There you go. And then we're going to put all the windmills side by side. <laughs> <laughs> this is like the best part of the map over here. I guess we'll throw in this big ass windmill over here with it. Okay, what houses do I got left? I got Ahmet's house. Where is she gonna live? We'll put her right there. And we'll put the hag. <laughs> Put her right there, so she's on that corner. Claude, can he fit in the middle? Aw, oh, there's not enough room. Man, you're gonna have to live by yourself somewhere. You can live over here on the side by yourself. New Amsterdam. <laughs> Let's see. We got some river and we got a bridge. Oof! I can't put a uh, can't put a bridge there. That makes me mad. I should have put the river then. We'll put it over here behind. And that does not look right. Put it there. And for some ungodly reason, we'll put the bridge right there. Because why not? Trees. We got some trees left. We got three whole trees left. corner in this little area over here. This is like the nicest place ever. And then the rest of this place is just barren and... I, wait, I should take all the fucking trees away so these people are just like treeless and then just put all the trees over here in the corner. <laughs> I believe that is everything. There is no materials left to place. This is the brand new Naroon village. It's absolutely gorgeous. Kind of hypnotizing. And up on top is the Fuhrer himself. Let's go see the Fuhrer. There he is. private chest. I wonder if Anne Frank was going to fly out of the closet. <laughs> Religious political party. <laughs> I, I, could, I could see that. Would, would you join their political party? You think it's going to be successful? <laughs> I like how 37%, like, almost, like, over a third of the population is happy with this. <laughs> over a third of the population is happy with this setup. I mean, how could you not be, though? I want to take a nice screenshot of this. All right. 
going to return to the other village. What time is it? 11.54. I wonder how many floors are left in this dungeon. How much stuff do I have? You're done, you're done. I need to go to this place and find what the other guy wants. So you need an upstairs cabin. There you go. Your house is done. Like I can just get wind in a chest. Oof. I got a whole thing of wind. Oh, he's in the middle of something. Oof. What's he doing? I just, I just wanted to hear. Uh, oh, no, never mind. That's not what they were doing. Invested with fairies. It was white, coiled. What the fuck are you talking about? Was it a poisonous apple? Oh damn, it'd be so funny if I gave him a poisonous apple to eat. <laughs> Wiped and it was coiled. Did you eat his dick? Like, I'm confused. Okay, gourd. You need more water. Didn't I get an apple of Eden earlier? Oh, wait, no, I gave it to the cat. Uh, Alright. Let's see, what else can we build? You, oh, this is an entire new house with no one living in it. It needs a storage room. That's not what I meant to click. That's what I meant to click. The mayor's house needs a sign. I need to go to the mail, the mail's, the mayor's house, see what he wants. Put that there. Put that there, put that there, okay. Let me go to the mayor's house and see what he's up to. <laughs> you gonna move into that house? I'll keep it reserved for you. I like how we're in a forested village, and he just said it never rains. Okay, so he said he needs a roof on his house. Lucky for you, I happen to have one roof. I forgot I can level up weapons without actually having to kill monsters. I can just use powder. But I gotta buy powder. I don't think I can buy it yet to fucking find it. Ooh, he wants me to come closer. Ooh, he's shaking with excitement. Take a seat. What are we doing, old man? I'm excited. You can tell me anything? About the mayor's youth. Yes, yeah, show me how youthful you are. Oh, you're one hell of a guy, huh? Oh, you won the post! Thank you. 
So my reward is information. Okay, I was about to say. What is it, old man? Give me something good. Oh my. I got a big brown gold. Sure, you can do whatever the hell you want to be. I don't know what the fuck of. If it, that's a long ass word. Right, scummin, sir. Right, scummin, saw. Whatever that is, you can do that. So this village is a fascist regime. I can see that. chest over here. I wanna get it. I wanna get it. Can I walk here please? Yeah, thank you. I got fish candy! It's actually very useful. Cause that's what you use to upgrade the kitty's defense. Fish candy. One button. Yeah, and I heard the is 19. Okay. Do I have everything I need to go? Okay. Give you some water. I'm gonna give you some water. Alright, I'm gonna do one more dungeon level. And then I'm gonna call it quits for today. that one. If this is the last one, I might be able to start off with my next broadcast with a boss fight. If you guys are interested in seeing that. Ooh, the werewolf. Yeah, I'm killing your furries. Are you happy? <laughs> First one I get, the one he wants. Nice. This is my least favorite enemy in the fucking forest area. It's such an asshole. For that fucking reason right there. Let's die!
bitch. Stop it. I'm about to die if I don't get over it. What? Like, why can I not attack this? Because that could have just been you did. Alright, this is ready to upgrade. Upgrade, yes. Justin and Michael for attending. There was a third person in there. I didn't see who that was, so thank you for watching as well, whoever that was. Um, I don't know when I'm going to do the next broadcast for the next episode or whatnot. I'll let you know, but until then, good night.